Hey queens, uh, welcome back. Uh, I'm gonna show you today how to do a pinko set, an authentic rigididge musical theater, sturdy as fuck pinko set to go under wigs for those of you who have long hair. Now what you're gonna need is a brush, a stocking cap, some pins, Barbie pins, and some short, short Frenchies, okay? So, we're gonna start by, well this is Alicia by the way. Say hi Alicia. She's very quiet. She told me the other day that uh, as shy as she is, that she really loves being the center of gang bangs. I'm one of those girls. Okay, so what we're gonna do is uh, put the hair in pink curls. Very, very simple. Take a section at the front. And depending on how long your hair is or how uh, thick your hair is, um, what would have, depend on how sort of how big the section of the pin curl is. Um, but I kind of like to do less pin curls and make them flatter than doing small ones and having too many pins and it's uncomfortable and blah blah blah. So in actual fact, I might just take that whole top of the section of the head. So as you can see, I've done. Come on, Alicia, show them. Show the nice people. Oh, oh, she's tightened on. Is she tightened on? Oh, I'm running out of battery. Oh, fuck. Okay. See? Hold top of the head. Okay. Now, just wrap it around your finger. All the fingers, nice and loosely but cleanly. And then place the curl over the section. Now, when you place, just get your fingers and just, just manipulate the hair a little bit to flatten it and to spread it out as much as possible to cover that whole area and then pin. Use as many pins as you need, but it's very important to not cross the pins because if you cross the pins, they stick out and it becomes very difficult. Um, and this, you know, very difficult to take wigs on and off, which is a, an issue in musical theater when you're doing quick changes, but I guess for you guys, it's really not that much of an issue. So, but I prefer just flat pins, just like that, okay? Now, repeat this over the whole head, taking nice big sections. Once again, flattening it out. And pinning. It's so easy and so quick. Okay, there's that one. Now I'm gonna do the rest uh, and then uh, I'll show the next step. Okay, so now I have gone through and pink curled the entire head and I've done one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pin curls. You can see that, nice and flat. Not necessarily the neatest, as in the curl itself. So when the curl comes out, it's not gonna be a lovely bouncy curl, have kinks in it everywhere, but it's gonna hold together beautifully. So once you've got that, then take your stocking cap. Put your stocking cap over any hair that's come out and it's a little bit there. Make it nice and neat because we like things that are neat. And then once you've got that, take your little Frenchies and just catch the stocking cap to the pink curls. So quick, so easy, and so effective. Okay, and oh, we'll do this as well, make it nice and tight. Because Alicia likes being tight. So rarely is she tight these days. So here we go. Okay, and there you have it. One beautiful, solid as fuck, rigididge, authentic pink curl set. And there we have it. Uh, another handy hint from your friendly wig witch slash wig it all um, for free. So appreciate it and like it. And, uh, and I'll see you back here next time. I love you and goodbye. Good luck wig dressing. Ah, be creative, be fun, be fabulous. Bye.